Hi everyone, Petal is this here. I'm coming on here today to share with you guys the sunburst mirrors that I'm going to attempt to make just using Dollar Tree products. Now I saw this picture of this sunburst mirror on Pinterest when I was on there looking at different design um, things that you can do. I liked it very much so I said I'm going to attempt to make that. So I went to Dollar Tree and um, I know that they have the the wooden sticks that you could use on the mirrors but I didn't want the wooden sticks because I would have to spray paint them and I think that's a little too much for me because the fumes bother me. So I didn't use the sticks but I'll show you what I use. Anyways here are the mirrors that I got. They didn't have round mirrors at my Dollar Tree. No square, no round. They had these um, uptangler ones. I don't know what this is called but that's what they had so I got two of those. <laughs> And I bought this artist canvas. It's round. They have it in Dollar Tree. So I picked up two of these because I want to make my mirror a little bigger. So I picked up two of those to use. And I picked up these forks to use as um, portraying out of my sunburst mirrors. 24 come in the pack. So I got those to use. And I have my bling out stickers. <laughs> um, I got these ones a while back. I honestly don't remember which store I bought them from. But I've had them for a while. So um, I think I'm going to try and use them on my sunburst mirrors. And I have my glue gun and I went and got some E6000 you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm so happy for that. I'm going to try this with my mirrors. Yeah, I think it will be a better hold. And I got this metallic spray paint from Walmart that I'm going to spray the round canvas boards with it. And this is very shiny, so I don't know if it'll come out shiny on the canvas boards, but as long as it gives it a silver color, it will be okay. All right, everyone, let's get started. Okay, so I spray painted the two canvases. So now I'm just going to um, glue my forks all the way around. I made little markings where I want to put them. So we're going to start and glue them down. Okay, everyone, you we need to put the glue onto the canvas. And then put the forks down. Do not put the glue onto the forks directly because it will make them melt. Which I learned when I was doing this. <laughs> See? They're melted. Alright. Now we're going to put the diamond gems all the way around. And now it's time to add the mirrors. We're going to glue them down with the E6000 and a little bit of the glue gun. I took off the um, the little black tabs at the back, not completely, but I took them some of them off so the mirror would be able to lie flat onto the canvas. When I had you, I was okay. I was okay. Though we 
go out, girl, I went with you like all day. Now I got a much different frame of mind. Switch it up. If you need advice, girl, don't take this, take mine. I'll admit, all the money that came in changed it all up. But now. And here we go. Two sunburst mirrors. I like them. I think they turned out really well. And this is where I placed them. All right, everyone. Thank you for joining me to see how I made these sunburst mirrors today. And remember, as always, stay blessed from Petal is Blessed. Bye-bye, everyone. All my life, I've been waiting for somebody like, body like you, like you, 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 you. Oh, yeah. And now I see that I'm money like you. Nowadays, my life's like a hurricane, ran through it.